Look at this. Look how many birds are here. Yeah, I know it's like a lot of them. Lots of wood storks. Didn't realize there was this many. Or they could be egrets. Great egrets, possibly. Yeah, pretty much spread upon all those trees right there. And really nothing to see over here. Oh yeah, there's more egrets right there too. Alright, hang on. Let me just check out the view of the area here. Oh yeah, and there's more of them. Yeah, it doesn't stop there. Keep in mind this is with digital zoom. And of course I'm losing focus because of the... Well, maybe because of my UV filter and possibly because of the heat too. Because it is very hot outside right now. Alright, so right now I'm just taking a little panorama of the area right here. I'm at Fort Clinch State Park right now. And there's more egrets. There's more egrets. See anything that I'm not seeing? Let me know. More egrets. Any more egrets? No. Oh, there's more egrets right there. Oh, there's another egret. Let's follow along as we're doing the panorama here. Yeah, I haven't seen the osprey yet, the one that was, that had the fish in its towns as it was flying away from me. I don't know where that osprey went to. But even if I could see it, it's not like I'd be able to film it. Not from this kind of distance. So I can only zoom in just a little bit more, as you can see. I try not to put the zoom level too much. That way uh, I can at least get a good view of at least what's in the area. So yeah, it's taking a little while for me to go through everything because I'm looking at such a wide angle or a wide view of everything. Yes, yeah, so you can see there's a bunch of houses here. See anything that I'm not seeing? Yeah, panorama time, yep. Keeping a steady pace on the camera here. I'm starting to twist here. See anything? No? Okay, and pretty much everything else is all just right near me, so... Nothing up there, obviously, okay, and then over here, of course, is where we first saw all those egrets, which there's still some on the ground there. Well, anyways, it's almost 5 o'clock, so I have to go because the park closes at 5, and then I'll just uh, walk through the Egan's Creek Greenway that's outside of the park. All right, I'm going.